not Bauhaus. That's my trousers. Oh, look, I found Jeremy's notes. Trousers, fat, Hitler, tiger, Mazda, alpha, modernism, minimalism. Minimalism, modernism, I think it created cubism, I think it created Picasso. No, not Cubism that, came thinking. about 10 or 15 years earlier, but go on. I don't think that... I think the Audi is Bauhaus, but I think it's got a very contemporary veneer. I mean, one shouldn't hang the whole argument on the Bauhaus, I don't think. It's, it's yeah. einfach nicht wahr, as they've said at the Bauhaus. It's just not true. What does it symbolise? The Audi symbolises freedom. Freedom! Like that. Yeah. Warm in there, isn't it? <clears throat> um, gentlemen, God is the reason why you might look at this car, the Mazda RX-8, and see it as something a bit unusual. The Mazda is a Japanese car. In understanding a little bit about why this car is different to our eyes. And you can see that expressed throughout Japanese culture and paintings, if you were to take... We're just going to see you put your hands in your pocket, because you're also referring to notes here. I, I can do that. Um, if you refer to catching catfish with a gourd from the 15th century by jiu-jitsu... One of the blokes up there is an expert on Japanese and Oriental art. You know that. <laughs> can you just reiterate some of those points? Which points? The, the ones that you just made. Did he feel a bit thick when you finished it? Thick? How do you think he's going to feel? He'll probably punch for I have eaten brighter vegetables than <laughs> you. You've put this car in a gallery. Yeah. What else are you going to have in an environment that surrounds it? Maybe to extend it further, maybe to have some other Japanese stuff in there. Do you have any examples that you think would be of value for the some potential visitors? Japanese paintings. By anyone in particular? I, that would be for perhaps, you know, specialists to choose. How did that go? I think well. I, I think well. Um, Do you know you're bright red? Yeah, I'm hot. Very hot. The boffins conferred and then called us all in to give their verdicts. I think the Audi is, um, you know, sort of constrained, it's modest, it's sort of tidy. But it's not saying, it doesn't say very much to me. You know, this lessness is less for me, not more. Uh, I'm most persuaded by the Alpha. I agree entirely, yes. The Mazda, um, I, I can look at it from various angles, and it just doesn't seem to be as clear-cut an expression of what the modern automotive coupe is, and I think that's the Alpha. In terms of the look, the style, everything that it denotes, we'd be happy to show that car in this gallery, the Alfa Romeo. Well, it's all right, because it Mail could just break down before it got here. Mail yes, you'd, get, you'd get oil all no, over your nice on, You can oil. stop being it petty and infantile. Yeah, yeah. These three men are experts in art and artistic expression. Well, they're wrong. It's only because I said freedom. That's what we're saying. 